hello everyone welcome back to our youtube channel and today we are going to see how to fix source tree not opening not starting and not working on windows 10 or 11 so source tree is a free git client for windows and mac that provides developers with a user friendly environment to work on git repositories however after the recent windows update many users are facing the issue with source tree which is not starting the issue occurs because of the windows update and the source tree application file is damaged and corrupted so it is common to have such technical hitches in certain applications after the new rollout of os but don't worry it can be fixed easily before getting into the video make sure you hit the like and subscribe button so that you will not miss the upcoming videos so method one clear the source tree app data folder so the first step is to clear the current update and the cache memory of the source tree files Press Windows R and type percentage local app data percentage in the input box and click on OK. Where you will see an Atlassian folder, just click on it and delete all the folders except the source tree folder. Close the folder path and restart your system and relaunch your file. So complete your registration and now uh, try pulling your file and see if it is working fine. If the issue persists then go to the method 2. So method 2 is uninstall and reinstall the source tree. Before uninstalling the source tree ensure you have cleared the local app data by following the previous step. Because the app data stores all the temporary data of the file. So it is high possible that the uh, error might occur in the future of even after the fresh installation. So first clear the app data then freshly install the source tree application. So type add or remove program in the search bar windows search bar. Click on it. So apps and future windows open and search for source tree. And click on uninstall. So now the source tree application has been removed successfully. Then go to the source trees official website. And click on download for windows. Click on the checkbox and click on download again so the now file is downloaded successfully so now go to the now go to the downloads and you will see the file is so right click on it and run as administrator if you now launch your source tree and now configure your git account with the source tree and try to pull the repositories you will see the application is working fine without any issues i hope you found this video useful uh, make sure you hit the like and subscribe button for more such videos thank you